Uh, oh, wait, look at that fault line on the other side. This yeah. is awesome. To be perfectly honest, that's exactly what I imagined the, the uh, um, Pacific Ridge. I mean, not the Pacific Ridge. <laughs> but this, yeah. yeah, the ridge is looking like that's what it looks like in maps, <laughs> but much, much bigger. <laughs> Oh yeah, the so Mid-Atlantic Ridge. <laughs> there you go. Uh, on Iceland, <laughs> it's that actually point. kind of looking like this. But oh you yeah. Have it, yeah. <laughs> but I'm guessing this <laughs> isn't a uh, divergent play boundary. <laughs> <laughs> if it is, we discovered something really new. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's just really a fault. I think we are soon getting into the zone. I mean, closer to California, where where we have many transform faults. Mm. So it might be that. I mean, here we are still related to the subduction zone, but probably we start to come in a little bit different regime from the geology where we have more faults. Okay, yeah. cool. Wow. I think this is where they filmed the, film the Death Star trench run. <laughs> 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 you fire your proton torpedoes at the end. Oh, and there. It's all matte in there. Yeah, yeah. See, along the, fr the small fracture there going in. <laughs> this is awesome. It turns up there a little bit, oh but it's like yeah. 20, 20 So it, it's kind of going, we're going along this, well I guess we could follow it and see. <laughs> I'm just curious how it relates to this mound, if it has any, yeah, any relation. It's Oops. about 10. Yeah, 10, 10, 12. All right. Okay, thank you. If it's going 10, yeah, I mean, that's along this, this, uh, mm -hmm. Contour here. Do you want to follow it for a bit? Yeah. yeah. All right, so if you're just tuning in or watching along, we found a very interesting uh, fault line along here. So uh, we're just following it along and checking out the mussels and uh, creatures that are living down here, hoping to find a good lot of bacterial mat uh, that we can take some mussel samples at. Yeah, this does this does go around yeah. this. Yeah. Mm -hmm. If this does go all the way around, or at least partially, <laughs> it kind of seems like it mm -hmm. blisters up. You know, the mound is blistering up, and at some point, there's these events where it separates. It's a moat. A little <laughs> road. <laughs> giant, giant moat. Drive on, yeah. I, yeah. Is it possible to zoom in while you're flying, or is that kind of tricky? Yeah, I can come down a bit lower, too. Mm -hmm. Okay. Would there be an extra small little current running through that trench? Bridge now? Possibly, yeah. yeah. Just curious. <laughs> uh, one of the viewers suggests we give this trench a name. <laughs> Do these sort of features get named? It's trenchy, trans a trenchy McTrench face. <laughs> <laughs> so it's all anything is named anymore. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> you know what you've started. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. I think yeah. that name should the be taken more seriously. Right. <laughs> it got so many people interested in marine vessels. Yeah, I think you're right. Like a lot of people didn't really think there may be oceanic research vessels until yeah. suddenly they were all voting for it to be named Brody McGregface. Oh, people would have followed it 